Hey guys, it's your boy Peter John. Welcome to the Burger Restaurant's Logo History, a video which will show you the history of logos from many burger restaurants. I hope you like it. First, I'm gonna talk about Burger King. It is an American multinational chain of hamburger fast food restaurants headquartered in Miami-Dade County, Florida. 1953 to 1954, here we have the logo of the first Burger King's name, Insta Burger King. There is a red circle on a white and red outline, and on it there is the word Insta in white text, and under it there is a white line. 1954 to 1957, they changed its name to Burger King. The sun has been removed, and the font has changed. 1957 to 1969, there is a man wearing a gold crown holding a cup and sitting on a burger, and under the burger there is a golden shape, and inside it, there are the words burger and king in orange text, and under them, there are the words home of the and whopper, also in orange text. 1968 to 1970, there are two yellow shapes representing burger buns, and between them there are the words burger and king in red text. 1970 to 1994, the font has slightly changed. Here is a commercial. Two Whoppers, two Whopper Juniors, and four Coca-Cola. And would I have to wait long if you made one Whopper with no pickle and no lettuce? No, sir. Hold the pickle, hold the lettuce. Special orders don't upset us. All we ask is that you let us serve it your way. Oh, well, in that case, could I have the other Whopper with extra ketchup? Sure. We can serve your grilled beef Whopper fresh with everything on top of any way you think. Now that's the way to do things, our way. Have it your way, have it your way at Burger King, Burger King. 1994 to 1999, the font of the text has changed and the shapes are now darker. Here is a commercial. Any sign of them yet? Nope. Execute, let's move, move, move. Huh. Where are they? Well, I'm sure they're on their way. Don't worry, they'll make it. They're coming! <laughs> I see them! They're here! Toy Story toys have arrived at Burger King with the stars from the magical Disney movie. Your kids can collect all six high-quality toys, one with every great-tasting $1.99 Kids Club meal, only at Burger King. Yeah, I knew you guys would make it. The $1.99 Kids Club meal at Burger King. 1999 to 2020, the font has changed, the burger buns are brighter, and now surrounding them there is a blue shape. Here is the print version, the inverted print version and a commercial. Dare to stack the Stacker King with flame-grilled beef, melted cheese, thick-cut bacon, and creamy Stacker sauce. Stack it single, double, or triple. The Stacker King, part of the King's collection, only at Burger King. 2020 to the present, there are two burger buns, and between them there are the words burger and king in red text. Here is the print version, the wordmark, the icon, the app icon, the version with the slogan and the commercial. All the flame grilled stacker saucy Big King taste you love is now on the two, four, five. for a limited time. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about McDonald's. It is an American multinational fast food corporation, founded in 1940 as a restaurant operated by Richard and Maurice McDonald in San Bernardino, California, United States. 1940 to 1948, here we have the logo of the first McDonald's name, McDonald's Famous Barbecue. There are the word McDonald's, famous and barbecue in black text and on the left and on the right there are two lines. 1948 to 1953, here we have the logo of the second McDonald's name, McDonald's Famous Hamburgers. There is a black rectangular shape, and inside it there are the words McDonald's, Famous and Hamburgers in white text and under it, the words buy em, buy, the and bag also in white text. Also, above the word McDonald's there is man wearing white clothes. 1953 to 1961, they changed its name to McDonald's. There is the word McDonald's in red text. 1961 to 1968, the font has changed, and now above the text, there are two golden arches in a red outline, and a yellow line passing through them, also in a red outline. Here is the symbol, the version of circle in the commercial. Introducing the world's newest, silliest, and hamburger eating as clown, Ronald McDonald. Now where is that clown? 
Oh, Ronald. 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 Hey, Ronald. Here I am, kid. Hey, isn't watching TV fun? Especially when you got delicious McDonald's hamburgers. <laughs> Ronald, you can't be on TV and watch it at the same time. Now, come on and meet the boys and girls. Oh, we've already met. I know we're going to be friends, too, because I like to do everything boys and girls like to do. Especially when it comes to eating those delicious McDonald's hamburgers. <laughs> A magic tray here keeps me well supplied. McDonald's hamburgers, french fries, and milkshakes. Watch for me on TV. We'll have lots of fun. He's Ronald McDonald, the hamburger happy clown. A McDonald's drive-in restaurant is his favorite place in town. 1968 to 1975, the arches are simpler, the red outline has been removed, the font of the text has changed. The text is now in black, and it was moved to the middle right of the arches. Here is a print version, the symbol, the wordmark, the 3D version, the blue version, and a commercial. I'm going to show you how McDonald's builds a, a Big Mac sandwich. It starts here with a lightly toasted bun, and then a pure beef hamburger, sizzling hot, a slice of cheddar blend cheese, and some crisp, fresh lettuce. Then, our own secret sauce. The club slice, toasted. Another hamburger. And a little more sauce, just for good flavor. Crisp dill pickles and the sesame seed crown. This is the sandwich. McDonald's new Big Mac sandwich for the bigger than average appetite. McDonald's is your kind of place. nineteen seventy five to nineteen ninety three now the arches and the text are inside a red rounded rectangle here is a commercial in man's never-ending quest to go faster ever faster there's a new way to breeze through meals mcdonald's new order by the number system get your favorite sandwich with large fries and medium coca-cola classic just by saying one mcdlt two big mac three water pounder with cheese mcdonald's new ordering by the number system as easy as one two three for today's people on the go 1993 to 2003, there are only the yellow arches with a black shadow. Here is the print version and a commercial. Oh, I'm late. And after lunch, we're going skateboarding. 2003 to 2003, the shadow of the arches has been removed, and now the arch is inside a red rounded square. Here is a commercial. It's that time of year again. North side versus south. Neighbor versus neighbor. Cubs versus Sox. To make sure we're all rooting on a full stomach, McDonald's is bringing back the tangy and juicy McRib sandwich. And when you make it an extra value meal, it's just $2.99. Also available, a Cubs Sox collector cup. Hey, with a deal like this, does it really matter who wins? Just kidding. 2003 to 2006, the square has been removed and the arches are thicker. Here is the print version, the 3D version, the slogan version, and the commercial. Toys based on Disney's newest movie, Chicken Little, in your McDonald's Happy Meal. I love it. 2006 to the present, the arches are thinner. Here is print version, the gray version, and a commercial. What makes McDonald's new signature crafted recipes so great? Maybe it's the guacamole made with Haas avocados. Or maybe it's the sweet barbecue sauce made with Vidalia onion. Oh no, I've got it. 
It has to be the bacon with maple seasoning. Wait, I know that look. It's the taste. McDonald's new signature crafted recipes, freshly prepared on your choice of tender chicken or 100% pure beef. Create your signature crafted sandwich today. 2018 to the present, now the logo is inside a red rounded square. Here is the rectangular version, the Canadian version, the European version, the version with the slogan, the version with the Spanish slogan, the safe version and a commercial. What's up world? Yeah you. I'm Travis Scott, this is my McDonald's order. Follow me. Here's my quarter pounder with lettuce, pickles, onions, ketchup, mustard and bacon. Here's my fries. Sometimes I do this. Then I dip them into barbecue sauce. Oh yeah, and my Sprite. Same order since back in Houston, and you can try too. Gotta go. The Travis Scott meal, just six dollars. Say Cactus Jack sent you. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Wendy's. It is an American international fast food restaurant chain founded by Dave Thomas on November 15, 1969, in Columbus, Ohio, 1969 to 1971. There is the word Wendy's in red text, and under it there is a black line, and on the right of it there is a black circle, and inside it, there is a red hair girl, and under the circle, there are the words old fashioned and hamburgers in black text. Here is the word mark and the icon. 1971 to 1972. Now on the top of the girl, there are the words quality as are and recipe in black text. 1972 to 1976. The girl is simpler, and the font of the text on the bottom has changed. Here is the icon and a commercial. When you love Wendy's hot and juicy hamburgers, <laughs> no sacrifice is too great. I love hot and juicy hamburgers because I've had so many that weren't. We make them as juicy as we can. If they trickle down your chin a little, we're sorry. Nineteen seventy-six to nineteen eighty-three. Everything is now on a yellow rectangle, and the word Wendy's, the black line, and the circle with the girl are now on a red shape. Here is a commercial. I have nothing against heat lamps for sore backs, but I don't want one to bake my already cooked hamburger. That's why I come here to Wendy's. At Wendy's, your hamburger comes to you hot off the grill. You can see it with your own eyes coming right off the grill. Look, you want heat lamps? Go to a health club. You want a hot and juicy hamburger? Go to Wendy's. I'm glad you said that. <laughs> well, I want to shake your hand. Well, congratulations. Wendy's. Wendy's. Ain't no. Ain't no. A reason to go anyplace else. 1983 to 2013, the circle is now on the top of the logo, the background is now red, and the words old fashioned and hamburgers are now a yellow shape. Here is a commercial. Wendy's founder Dave Thomas spent a lot of time talking to customers so he knew you had a passion for hot and spicy. And that's why Wendy's brought it back. Our wild mountain chicken sandwich with Wendy's spicy chicken filet and its fiery blend of peppers and spices made even spicier with a hot and smoky southwestern pepper sauce and topped with Colby Jack cheese and bacon. It's the way Dave would have done it. So what are you waiting for? Wendy's. It's better here. Wendy's pickup window is open till midnight or later. 2007 to 2013, the girl is brighter, the yellow shape has been removed, and the words old fashioned and hamburgers have been removed. Here is a commercial. Oh, here's one. Uh, this movie is I get married at the end. What about this? Turns out he's an alien. Yeah. Okay. The whole thing's one big dream. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. How about the one where a group of friends encounter something totally unexpected? Very spicy. How's it end? With you driving us to Wendy's. Uh, Wendy's Asiago Ranch Chicken Club is totally unexpected. Our boldly spicy whole filet, applewood smoked bacon, and natural Asiago cheese. Way past ordinary. That's Wendy's way. Now that's better. And now get a Frosty for just 99 cents. 2015 to the present, there is a black circle, and inside it there a red hair girl and under the circle, there is the word Wendy's in red text. Here is the icon, the word mark, the version with the slogan and the commercial. Biggie bag, huh? It's new from Wendy's. It's everything you ever wanted for just five bucks. Everything I ever wanted? Wendy's bacon double stack, four nuggets, fries, a drink, and the spelling bee medal you lost in second grade because you couldn't spell soliloquy. It really is everything I ever wanted. Get a bacon double stack with a quarter pound of fresh beef, nuggets, fries, and a drink for just five bucks. Wendy's biggie bag is everything you ever wanted. Sorry, I'm gonna need all that back. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Arby's. 
It is an American fast food sandwich restaurant chain, with more than 3,300 restaurants system-wide and third in terms of revenue. 1964 to 1978, here we have the logo of the first Arby's name, Arby's Roast Beef Sandwich. There is a brown cowboy hat, and inside it, there are the word Arby's Roast Beef Sandwiches and delicious in white text. 1976 to 2012, they changed its name to Arby's. The hat is now simplified and red, and in the middle of the head, there is the word Arby's in red text. Here is the 3D version and the commercial. For years, you've eaten Angus beef the way the man wants you to. Well, now it's time to enjoy Angus beef the way it was meant to be. Oh yeah. Finally, Angus beef done right. Oven roasted, freshly sliced. Introducing the Angus three cheese and bacon. Arby's. It's good mood food. 2012 to 2013, the hat is now 3D, and the font of the text has changed. Here is the 2D version and a commercial. Try Arby's new market fresh turkey bacon Florentine sandwich. Arby's slicing up freshness. 2013 to the present, the hat is 2D again, it is smaller, and the font has changed. Here is the inverted version, the slogan version, a variant in the commercial. We took their beer to braise our meats, we took their pretzel buns, we took their mustard and their cheese, but we weren't quite done. We took their name and tweaked it and voila, Meatoberfest, these Germans tried the sandwiches. And we were all impressed. Us Germans tried these sandwiches and we were all impressed. Where's your accents? I thought you guys were German. I'm from Atlanta. There's gotta be Germans in Atlanta. What? Arby's, we have the meat. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Carl's Jr. It is an American fast food restaurant chain operated by CKE Restaurant Holdings Incorporated, with franchisees in North and South America, Asia, Asenia, Europe, and Africa. 1944 to 1956, here we have the logo of the first Carl's Jr. S name, Carl's Drive-In Barbecue. There is a black star and under it there is a black rectangle, and inside it, there is the word Carl's in white text, and under this rectangle there is a black shape, and inside it, there are the words drive-in and barbecue in white text. 1956 to 1975, they changed its name to Carl's JR. There are the words Carl's and JR in red text, and under them there is a yellow star on a red outline holding a soda and a burger, and on the bottom right of it, there are the words not just a burger, but a Carl's Nad hamburger in red text. 1975 to 1978, there is a black and white drawing of a star with a face smiling and wearing two boots, and on top of it, there is a burger and a drink, and under the star there is a gray shape, and on it, there are the words Carl's Jr. and restaurants in white text on a black outline. 1978 to 1987, there is a yellow star with a red face on it on a red outline, and under it, there are the words Carl's and JR in red text. Here is a commercial. The California roast beef sandwich, Carl's real onion rings. At Carl's Jr., you've got taste. 1987 to 2006, the text is now on the right of the star. Here is the stacked version and a commercial. When I was a kid, my heroes came from the Wild West. Carl Karcher was raised the old-fashioned way. But while most boys dreamed of riding the range, I dreamed of driving a chuck wagon. Today, you can taste the flavor of the West in Carl's new Double Western Bacon Cheeseburger. The only charbroiled double cheeseburger with crisp bacon, golden onion rings, and Carl's own hickory barbecue sauce. There is nothing like a good Western double feature because you'll still find good old-fashioned American values at Carl's Jr. 2006 to 2017, the font has changed, the text is now in silver text, now everything is on a red 3D shape, and now under the words Carl's and JR, there are the words charbroiled and burgers in yellow text. Here is the 2D version and the commercial. New at Carl's Jr. Eat like you mean it. 2017 to 2018, there is a yellow star with a face on it, and on the right of it, there are the words Carl's and JR in black text. Here is a variant in the commercial. If you got five bucks, you could get 9.96 like, inches of sandwich. Woo! Or you can get a real meal with a charbroiled double cheeseburger, dog, fries, and a cookie. The $5 All-Star Meals, only at Carl's Jr. and Hardy's. 2018 to 2022, the star is now a red outline. Here is the stacked version, the icon, a variant in the commercial. So I want everybody to remember that the Employee of the Month parking spot uh, is... I have a question. Mark. Is this the <laughs> room where all hope business. goes to die? Shh. Not now. Q2 uh. is really gonna stretch us. Stretch? Stretch like a crispy wheel of ooey gooey cheese on top of a charbroiled Angus patty covered in boom boom sauce? 
Would they, they notice if I left? Nah, this whole company is about to become irrelevant anyway. <laughs> Introducing the new BFC Angus Thick Burger at Carl's Jr. and Hardee's. Feed your happy. 2022 to the present, the star is now being seen from another perspective. Here is the icon, the stacked version, the dual brand version and a commercial. Don't fall for clickbait, fall for cluckbait with a doubly delicious chicken deal only at Carl's Jr. and Hardee's. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Hardee's. It is an American fast food restaurant chain operated by CKE Restaurants Holdings Incorporated, with locations primarily in the southern and midwestern United States. 1960 to 1967, there is the word Hardee's in black text, and on the right of it, there is a red shape, and on it there is a chef and a barbecue grill, and three white stars on a black outline, and on the stars, there are the words shakes french fries soft and drinks in red text. 1967 to 1969, there is the word Hardee's in black text, and on the right of it, there is a black and white drawing of a grill with fire coming out of it. 1969 to 1975, there is a weird orange shape, and on the right of it, there is the word Hardee's in black text. Here is a commercial. Excuse me, mister, but what's a Hardee's Husky Jr.? Well, my friend, let's define the question here and now. How exactly does a Hardee's Husky Jr. stack up? First of all, you take a fresh toasted bun. Oh. Oh, and add a char boiled patty. A pure, pure beef patty. Top it off with a slice of mild cheese. Oh, oh let me tell you, another pure beef patty. Two pure, pure beef patty. patty. That's right, my friends. Then Hardy's adds some cool green lettuce. Then we top it with special a sauce a and, a and a, a sensational a sesame a seed a bun. There you have it, my boy. What do you say to that? Well, my friend, give me a Hardy Husky Jr. 1976 to 1997. There is the word Hardy's in black text. Here is a commercial. There's something very new and very special at Hardee's. Something so big, so beefy, people are ordering it in a very special way. A big cheese. The big cheese is Hardee's special new double cheeseburger. It's so special, people are stepping up and saying, A big cheese. A big cheese. Hardee's new big cheese. Smile when you say that. 1997 to 2006, there is a yellow star on a red outline, and with a red smile on it, and under the star, there is the word Hardee's in red text. Here is the horizontal version and the commercial. The cinnamon and raisin biscuit at Hardee's. Without us, some guys would starve. 2006 to 2017, there is a 3D yellow star on a red outline, and on the right of it, there is the word Hardee's in white text on a red outline, and under it, there are the words charbroiled and thick burgers in yellow text, also on a red outline. Here is the stacked version, the 2D version, the 3D version and the commercial. Compared to breakfast at Hardee's, others don't look like much. Texas Toast Breakfast Sandwiches, new at Hardee's. 2017 to 2018, there is a yellow star with a black smiling face on it, and on the right of the star, there is the word Hardee's in black text. Here is a commercial. From 2018 to 2022, the star is now on a red outline. Here is the stacked version, the icon and the commercial. The new BFC Frisco breakfast sandwich at Hardee's has a crispy wheel of ooey gooey cheese inside. Because somewhere out there, a man named Greg is eating overnight oats. Sorry, Greg. Introducing the new BFC Frisco breakfast sandwich at Hardee's. Feed your <laughs> 2022 to the present, the star is now being seen from another perspective. Here is the icon, the stacked version, the dual brand version and the commercial. It's the Carl's Jr. and Hardy's Happy Star. And the famous Star Burger. And the Super Star Burger. So many stars. My Rewards members get exclusive offers on the Carl's Jr. and Hardy's app. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Five Guys. It is an American fast casual restaurant chain focused on hamburgers, hot dogs, and french fries, and headquartered in Lorton, Virginia. 
1986 to 2005, there are two red and white checkboards, and between them there are the words Five Guys Famous Burgers and and fries in red text. 2005 to the present, there are the words Five and Guys in red text. Here is a variant in the commercial. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about an in out burger. It is an American regional chain of fast food restaurants with locations primarily in California and the Southwest. 1948 to 1954, there is a red sign, and inside it there are the words in and out and burger in white text. 1954 to the present, there are the words in and out and burger in red text and divided by the letter N there is a yellow arrow on a red outline. Here is a commercial. Everything pretty. Nothing goes in, that's no lie, that's what goes in it, in and now, that's what it's all about, in and out, in and out, that's what a hamburger all about. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Jack in the Box. It is an American fast food restaurant chain founded February 21, 1951, by Robert O. Peterson in San Diego, California, where it is headquartered. 1951 to 1962, there is a surprise box. 1962 to 1971, there is a clown face smiling, and under it there is a black square, and on it, there are the words Jack in the inbox in white text. Here is a commercial. about going to a jack-in-the-box, you don't have to get all dressed up. 1971 to 1978, they changed its name to Jack-in-the-Box Hamburgers. There is a red cube, and inside it there are the words Jack-in-the-in-box in white text, and under them there is the word Hamburgers in white text. Here is a commercial. Is that Jack-in-the-box? Yeah, from Jack-in-the-box. Here's a bun, here's a meat patty, Here's a uh, tomato, here's an onion ring, here's a pickle, here's a lettuce, and some jack. Can you have a bite, Granny? Sure, I'll help you. Have a bite. Well, how you like Jumbo Jack? To stick Granny. Nineteen seventy eight to nineteen eighty, they changed its name back again to Jack in the Box. There is a red rounded square, and inside it there is a white crown, and under it there is a white circle, and under it there are white circles, and under the square, there are the words Jack in the inbox in red text. Here is a commercial. I'd like a taco, please. Hey, you got it. And a hamburger. You don't got it. Why not? Because we don't got it. We're Taco Town. They don't got it. Can I get two hamburgers? Uh, yes, sir. With french fries? Yes, sir. What about an omelet? Sure. Got a couple eggs. <laughs> Got a couple eggs? Now what? Got a couple of eggs? <laughs> Welcome, sir, to Jack in the Box. You got tacos? Yes, sir. You got hamburgers? Yes, sir. You got omelets? Yes, we do. You got french fries and onion rings? Yes, sir. You got a steak sandwich? We got it. <sighs> if you haven't been to Jack in the Box restaurants lately, come on in. We're cooking up a lot more than great hamburgers. Now you're, you're cooking, cooking Jack. 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 Jack in the Box. Now you're cooking Jack. 1980 to 1985, there is a red rounded tilted square, and inside it, there are the words Jack in the inbox in white text. 1985 to 1986, they changed its name to Monterey Jacks. There is a dark square and inside it there is the word Monterey in white text, and under it there is a yellow and red shape, and under it there are two white lines, and between them there is the word Jacks in white text. Here is a commercial. 
You know what's weird? Yeah, you. No, those hamburger places. I mean, try it, Brian. Try it, I don't Brian. believe it. Me neither. At Monterey Jack's, they care about taste. And they let you in? They've got seared and seasoned burgers that taste great, like the Monterey Jack burger. Beef, thick and juicy. And that goes double. Extra cheese, tangy sauce. A real burger. And I'm real hungry. The Monterey Jack Burger, only at Monterey Jack's. Lonely, too! In 1986 to 2009, they finally changed its name back again to Jack in the Box. There is a red rounded tilted square, and inside it, there are the words Jack in the Inbox in white text. Here is a commercial. Guys, come on, we've been over this a million times. Pencil neck, pigtail, at least I don't need salt. Salt is for suckers! Hey, I'm not saying I like one fry better than another. It's just for a limited time when guests buy a combo, they can upgrade to seasoned curly fries for free. Corkscrew, sucker! Don't make me get out my bag! Stop it! This free fry swap is for a limited time, so I expect you to behave like professional potatoes! Mr. Box needs a vacation. 2009 to 2022. There is a red cube and on it there is the word Jack in white text, and under this cube, there are the words in the inbox in red text. Here is a commercial. Sometimes a little bite can pack a lot of flavor, like my taste bud tingling buffalo popcorn chicken, made with Frank's Red Hot. So don't resist, get saucy anywhere. Pop my 100% all-white meat buffalo or classic popcorn chicken combo for just $4.99. 2022 to the present, the font of the words in the inbox has changed. Here is the icon, the horizontal version and the commercial. Hello Salt Lake City, this is the face of all day breakfast, late night munchies and the biggest most delicious menu on the planet. Hello Ronald, this is the face of your worst nightmare. Hope to see you soon! Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Culver's. It is an American fast casual restaurant chain founded in 1984 by George, Ruth, Craig, and Lee Culver. 1984 to 1990, there is a blue rounded shape, and inside it, there is the word Culver's in white text and on the bottom right of it, there are the words frozen custard and butterburgers all in white text. Here is a commercial. Fish is delicious, sandwiches are dishes, Culver's better than Norwegian cocktails. Sandwiches are dishes, delicate, delicious, Culver's better dip, Norwegian cocktails. 1990 to 1997, the text is now centralized. 1997 to 2006, the logo is the same as the first logo. Here is a commercial. So why did you vote Culver's the best burger chain in America? One reason is our signature butter burger. The Culver's Deluxe. We start with fresh, never frozen U.S. beef on a lightly buttered toasted bun. Then top it with real Wisconsin cheese, lettuce, tomato, mayo, pickle, onion, and as always, the Culver's Deluxe Butter Burger is cooked to order just for you. So come on into Culver's. And thanks for making us the, the best, best burger chain in America. 2006 to 2011, the word Culver's is bigger and on a blue outline. Here is a commercial. I am a butter burger. People look forward to me all day. I'm not saying I'm superior to other burgers. But to the thousands who share that opinion, I say thank you. Yes, I am a butter burger. And I'm here to culverize you. Culver's, get culverized. Try the Culver's Deluxe in a value basket and upgrade to a shake for a meal and dessert all in one. 2011 to the present, there is just the word Culver's in blue text. Here is a commercial. Jags, Matt Mitchell down at Culver's. Have you ever wondered why things taste so amazing when you come to Culver's? It's because it's fresh. We make it just for you. When you say, I want a burger, someone starts making a burger. When you want french fries, someone starts cooking french fries. We also make fresh frozen custard throughout the day. It's always within an hour of fresh when you eat it. Not something that's been packed and sitting around a freezer forever. It's fresh, it's delicious, it's so creamy. So come see us down at Culver's, we can't wait to have you. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Dairy Queen. 
It is an American fast food chain of soft serve ice cream and fast food restaurants, owned and operated by International Dairy Queen Incorporated, which also owns Orange Julius and formerly owned Carmel Kern and Golden Skillet Fried Chicken. Its corporate offices are in Bloomington, Minnesota. 1940 to 1948, unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this logo. 1948 to 1959, there are the words Dairy and Queen in black text. 1960 to 2007, there is a red shape, and inside it, there are the words Dairy and Queen in white text. Here is a commercial. What makes a Dairy Queen frozen Valentine cake so special? Because it's made with a sweetheart of treats, delicious Dairy Queen chocolate and vanilla soft serve, and a big hug of chocolate fudge and chocolate crunch. But the icing on the cake is you can get it decorated our way or your way. The Dairy Queen Valentine cake, the most delicious way you can say, be my Valentine. We treat you right. Dairy Queen. 2001 to 2007, the shape is brighter, and the words Dairy and Queen were replaced to the letter D and Q in white text. Here is a commercial. Let's see, Grant wants chicken, chicken. Lindsay wants a burger, burger, and I want steak fingers. You poor dear, you'll be driving all over town. Hey, no problem. Hamburgers, chicken fried steak, grilled chicken, steak fingers. Pleasing the family is easy with DQ combo meals, served with fries and soft drink, and value priced at Dairy Queen. And Grant wants a banana split, Lindsay wants a chocolate chip cookie dough blizzard, I'll take a peanut buster parfait, and while you're there, pick up a Sunday Treat and, and eat at Dairy Queen. 2007 to the present, the font has changed, the shape is darker, and now on the top and on the bottom of the shape, there are two other shapes, one yellow and one blue. Here is the word mark and the commercial. Date night at DQ with their amazing new chicken and waffles basket. Chicken strips. Belgian waffles. Savory. Sweet. My lady. My man. Your daughter. I love our daughter. Mm. DQ, happy, tastes good. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about White Castle. It is an American regional hamburger restaurant chain with 377 locations across 13 states, with its greatest presence in the Midwest and New York metropolitan area. 1921 to 1983, there are the words white and castle in dark blue text. Here is a commercial. I miss you, mama. I miss the city, too. What if we sent you a little bit of your hometown? Now, how are you gonna do that? Nineteen eighty three to nineteen ninety six, there is a black rounded rectangle, and inside it there is a white shape representing a castle, and under the black rectangle there are the words white and castle in black text. Here is a commercial. White Castle Double Cheeseburger. Meet the double cheeseburger in second to none. Two beef patties with zesty onion. Crisp dill pickle on an oven baked bun. Simply delicious. 1996 to 2003, there is a white shape representing the top of a castle, and on it there are the words white and castle in purple text. Here is a commercial. Mm. Yeah. Clean the inside too, mister? Just the outside. White Castle. What you crave. Got an extreme crave? Get 20 burgers and four orders of fries. 2003 to the present, the shape now is shorter, and on a blue outline, one side of the shape is now yellow, and the text is now stacked, and in blue text. Here is the version with the slogan and the commercial. Say cheese. Cheese. At White Castle, we know how to make Cravers smile. Cheese up your favorite slider with new French onion cheese, new roasted garlic cheese, and Craver fave jalapeno cheese. And now, choose any cheese on a 10-sack of original sliders for 8 dollars 
And don't forget about our sides. Cheese? That's right, like loaded cheese fries, new cheese curd nibblers, and mozzarella sticks. <laughs> Try them all anytime for a limited time, only at White Castle. Cheese! Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Sonic Drive-In. It is the operator of an American drive-in fast food restaurant chain that is owned by Inspire Brands, the parent company of Arby's and Buffalo Wild Wings. 1953 to 1959, here we have the logo of the first Sonic Drive-In's name, Top Hat. There are the words top and hat in red text, and under them there are the words drive and in in black text, and under it there is a red hat. 1959 to 1974, they changed its name to Sonic Drive-In. There is the word Sonic in red text, and behind it there are a bunch of red lines, and under them there is a black shape, and on it, there are the words drive and in in white text. 1974 to 1981, the black shape and the words on it have been removed. Here is a commercial. Nineteen seventy eight to nineteen ninety six. There is the word Sonic in dark red text. Here is a commercial. Get ready for a carload of flavor from your nearby Sonic drive in. The Sonic recipe for good taste calls for freshness every day. Choice ground beef, nutritious potatoes, garden fresh onions, and the fresh ingredients that make our conies a legendary taste sensation. Spin into Sonic for a carload of flavor. It's made to order when we hear from you. Welcome to Sonic. May I take your order, please? 1996 to 1998. The font has slightly changed. Here is a variant and a commercial. When is the official last day of summer? I have no idea. At Sonic, summer's a state of mind. It just keeps going and going and going. <laughs> This month at Sonic, you can get one of our old-fashioned floats or one of our new blended flurries for a special low price. It always feels like summer at Sonic. So we've been Drive into Sonic this month and get our Junior Double Cheeseburger for a special low price. 1996 to 2020, there are two light blue shapes on a yellow outline, and on them there is a yellow shape on a blue outline, and on it, there is the word Sonic in red text on a blue outline. Here is the red version and the commercial. But how long will that take, you think, maybe? Two minutes. Thank you. One, one thousand. Two, one thousand. Sixty-nine, one thousand. Sixty, one thousand. I think I had a birthday after I ordered, but before I got my soda. Happy birthday. Speedy service. Sonic's got it, others don't. Try Sonic's big new Smoky Super Sonic. Pepper Jack and Smoky Cheddar Cheese on two patties with our Smoky Texas sauce. Served up hot and fast. It's not just good, it's Sonic good. 2020 to the present, there is a blue shape, and inside it there is the word Sonic in red text. Here is the version with the slogan and the commercial. I don't even think I can make this at home for $3.99. No, you have to buy the meat, you have to buy the queso, you have to buy the bread, you have to buy the cheese, you gotta buy the grill, <laughs> you gotta buy everything. Queso burger. Ooh. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Mr. Beast Burger. It is an American virtual restaurant founded and developed by internet personality Jimmy Donaldson in partnership with Virtual Dining Concepts, LLC. 2020 to 2021, there is a drawing of two burger buns with ketchup lettuce and something blue between them all of that on a black outline, and between these things, there are the words Mr. Beast and Burger in yellow text on a blue, red and black outline. Here is the print version, the word mark and the commercial. If you like what you saw in this video, you too can eat Beast Burgers. I live as soon as possible. I love you guys. 2021 to the present, the drawing is more simple, the lettuce is now pink, and the text is now only on a black outline. Here is the word mark and the commercial. We just opened our very first physical Mr. Beast Burger in the same location we shot this video. It's located inside of the American Dream Mall in New Jersey. This Beast Burger will be open forever and specifically on September 4th, I'm gonna be working the cash register all day. And while you're here, make sure you check out the theme park, the water park, and everything else the American Dream Mall has to offer. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Whataburger. 
It is an American privately held, regional fast food restaurant chain, headquartered and based in San Antonio, Texas, that specializes in hamburgers. 1950 to 1968, there is a blue sign on a white and blue outline, and on it, there is the word Whataburger in white text, and under the sign there is a blue and white drawing of a restaurant. 1968 to 1972, there is the word Whataburger in black text, and under it, there are the words drive and inns in black text, and on the left of them, there is a black and white drawing of a restaurant, and under it, there are the words there's one near and you in black text. 1972 to the present, there are five orange lines representing a letter W, and under these lines, there is the word Whataburger in orange text. Here is a commercial. Is it possible to fit a square peg into a round hole? Well, if that square peg is Whataburger's patty melt, and that round hole is your kisser, you betcha. The Whataburger patty melt is back. Two patties, jack cheese, creamy pepper sauce, and grilled onions on Texas toast. What a burger! Just like you like it. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Jollibee. It is a Filipino multinational chain of fast food restaurants owned by Jollibee Foods Corporation. 1975 to 1978, here we have the logo of the first Jollibee's name, Magnolia. There is a blue shape and on it there is the word Magnolia in white text. 1978 to 1980, here we have the logo of the second Jollibee's name, Jollibee Yumburger. There is a character holding a hamburger and under him there are the words Jollibee and Yumburger in red text. Here is a commercial. The one with 100% pure beef. The one with 100% pure beef. 1980 to 1983, there is a red rectangle, and on it there are the words Jollibee and Yumburger in white and yellow text, and on the right of them, there is a drawing of a red, white, and yellow bee, holding a burger while smiling. 1983 to 1996, they changed its name to Jollibee. There is a red square and inside it there is the Jollibee's face, and under the square there is the word Jollibee in white text on a black outline. Here is the print version and a commercial. Jollibee, apat na sikat, tipid meals. Mamili sa sikat number one, sikat number two, sikat number three, o sikat number four. Napaka-affordable kasi 39 pesos lang. Sari-saring saya, sari-saring sarap. At home sa Jollibee, buong araw. Jollibee, apat na sikat, tipid meals. I love you, Jollibee. 1996 to 2011, there is Jollibee's face, and under him, there is the word Jollibee in red text. Here is the word mark and the commercial. Frederick, Aga, is a pang tag. Is a pang tag? Look, especially this chicken one. Chicken dinner, chicken dinner, of course. Look, look, look. Look, Chris, please. I have to do it all over again because... Do! Let's go. Be happy, be a joy. Basta my Jollibee Chicken Joy. Break, Mona. Break, Mona. 2011 to the present, the logo is darker. Here is the word mark and the commercial. Oh, tinanggap ba? Ayaw po eh. Galit pa po eh. Ano ko? Jollibee! Kuya, pati na tayo. Sige, sayo na lang itong balat. Merry Christmas! Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Hungry Jack's. It is an Australian fast food franchise of the Burger King Corporation. 1971 to 1995, there are two yellow shapes representing yellow bun halves, and between them there are the words Hungry and Jack's in red text. 1995 to 1997, the buns are darker, and the font has changed. 1997 to the present, the font has changed. Here is a variant and a commercial.
Got my plant-based Rebel Whopper, your triple Whopper cheese. And my double Homestyle Whopper. Try Hungry Jack's new Homestyle Whopper with eye bacon, barbecue, chipotle and crispy bacon. Whopper your way, only at Hungry Jack's. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Bob's. It is a Brazilian fast food chain, founded in 1952 by the American-Brazilian tennis champion Bob Falkenberg, Wimbledon tournament winner in 1948. 1952 to 1960, there is a red and white drawing of an ice cream, and on it, there is the word Bob's in red text. 1960 to 1970, there is the word Bob's in red text. 1970 to 1988, there are four red shapes and three red lines, and on the right of them, there is the word Bob's in red text, and on the right of it, there are four red shapes and three red lines. Here is a commercial. A Indiana está comendo esse hambúrguer. Deixa eu ver. Ela deve estar no. Não, olha bem. Ela está gostando. É, tá gostoso. Ah, então ela está no Bob's. O que a gente não encontra por aí, a gente encontra no Bob's. 1988 to 2002. There is a red rounded shape, and inside it, there is the word Bob's in red text. Here is a variant and a commercial. Você vai viver as emoções do triângulo amoroso Bob. É preciso escolher. Hot dog com laranja Bob. Ou... Hambúrguer com laranja Bob. Faça a sua escolha. Triângulo Amoroso Bob. Você vai amar o preço. Ó oh, dúvida cruel. 2002 to 2014. There is the word Bob's in red and yellow text on a blue outline. Here is the horizontal version, a variant in the commercial. Sabe que dia é hoje? Sim. Dia do Big Bob. Você sabe que dia é hoje? Claro que sei. Dia de Double Barbecue. Super oferta Bob's. Todo dia um delicioso sanduíche por apenas seis reais. Bob's não dá para controlar. 2014 to 2021. There is the word Bob's in red text. Here is a commercial. Quando inventa um padrão, parece que quem não seguir vai ser o único diferente. Você é a próxima, né? Ah, eu não quero ter filho. Mas você não tá sozinho. Tem um monte de gente nessa. Relaxa, aqui no Bob's a gente também não segue padrão. Ó oh, o australiano artesanal, carne maior e mais suculenta. E você pode dobrar o ingrediente e botar molho à vontade. Relaxa aí, Bob's. 2021 to the present, the text is darker. Here is a commercial. Os sabores de responsa do Bob's estão na área. Tem o Super Cheddar de responsa, com hambúrguer suculento e duas camadas de cheddar super cremoso. Chega junto! Esse é o Bob's Bacon de responsa, com hambúrguer bruto, muito bacon crocante e a nova Bacon Nese Bob's. Aí brincou! E tem o Mega Queijo de responsa, uma explosão de sabor pra quem ama queijo. Deu vontade, né? Bob sabores de responsa. Pega o seu! Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Bembo's. It is a Peruvian fast food chain offering hamburgers, often with Peruvian-influenced variations. 1988 to 1995, here we have the logo of the first Bembo's name, Bembo's Burger Grill. There are four yellow lines and on them there is the word Bembo's in dark blue text, and under it, there are the words Burger and Grill in red text. 1995 to 2005, there is the word Bembo's in dark blue text, and under it there are three yellow lines, and on them there is the word Bembo's in red text, and under the lines, there are the words burger and grill in dark blue text. Here is a commercial. Vemos, no hay otra. 
2005 to 2014, they changed its name to Bembos. There is the word Bembos in dark blue text on an orange outline, and under the letters B and O there is an orange and red shape. Here is a commercial. Y ahora la vemos. Twenty fourteen to the present, there is a red line, and under it, there is the word Bembos in dark blue text, and under it, there is a yellow line. Here is a commercial. En 30 años, nada ha cambiado. La música sigue siendo chévere. Seguimos llegando a donde esté. Y ese antojito de sabor peruano en la hamburguesa aún sigue. Porque desde 1988 seguimos contigo. Y es que como vemos, no hay otra. Y por nuestros 30 años regresamos el saborcito peruano de la criolla, la carretillera y la a lo pobre. Ok, now I'm gonna talk about McDonald's Brazil. It is an American multinational fast food corporation that got its first location in Brazil on February 13, 1979 in Rio de Janeiro. 1979 to 1984, there is a yellow letter M, and inside it there is the word McDonald's in black text. 1984 to 2003, now the letter and the word are inside a red rounded rectangle, and the word McDonald's is now in white text. Here is a commercial. <laughs> Two thousand three to two thousand six, there is a letter M in yellow text. Here is a commercial. Deixa que eu invento uma desculpa melhor pra sua mãe. Vai ver, né? Pode acreditar. No McDonald's, agora tem chicken grill com peito de frango grelhado. E até água de coco, saladas e muito mais. Um novo cardápio feito só pra você. E a joca! 2006 to the present, the letter is less thicker. Here is the version with the slogan and the commercial. Quarteirão, Mac Chicken, Shadda, Mac Melt. Que delícia, nem sei o que pedir. Big Mac. Saudade de um Big Mac, né, Fê? Uhum. Dois hambúrgueres, alface, queijo, molho especial, cebola e picles, um pão com gergelim. É Big Mac, Big Mac. Peça o mais amado. Peça o número um. Hum. Ai, que saudade que eu tava. 2019 to the present. Now under the letter M there is the word Mecwi in black text. Here is a commercial. Chegou o M do Mac, pra você transformar sua casa no seu próprio McDonald's. Realize o sonho do Mac próprio e peça o seu M do Mac pelo delivery, drive-thru ou no McDonald's mais próximo de você. Ok, now I'm gonna talk about McDonald's Turkey. It is the Turkish operation of McDonald's, an American multinational fast food chain, founded in 1940 as a restaurant operated by Richard and Maurice McDonald in San Bernardino, California, United States. 1986 to 2003, there is a red rounded rectangle, and inside it there is a yellow letter M, and in it, there is the word McDonald's in white text. Here is a commercial. McDonald's'ta reservasyon yok, garson yok, bekleme yok. McDonald's 
2003 to 2006, there is a letter M in yellow text. Here is a commercial. His story would have been much more fun if we Turks had been first on inventions. If we had made the first fire, we would have started the shish kebabi cage. If we had been the first on moon, no gravity hoedown would certainly have beaten rock and roll down. If we had made the first robot, we'd never make the second one to protect the humankind. What if we made the first hamburger? Well, it would definitely have a huge spicy meatball with rich onions and garlic, all in a thick bread. The new Max Burger, Turkish way of hamburger. McDonald's, we are loving it. Two thousand six to the present. The letter M is thinner. Here is a commercial. Ay! Dün ne kadın çocuk var ya? Burcu'nun sevgilisi çıktı. Ah! O diyor da kızım. Esas efsane Big Mac sos çıktı. Ah! Efsane Big Mac sos. Şimdi McDonald's'ta. McDonald's'a gel, keyfin yerine gelsin. Am Burcu da pek sevmem zaten. Okay, guys. This is it for today. I really hope you liked it. Stay tuned for the next episode of Logo History Colors. And also don't forget to join my Discord server and to subscribe to my channel so you can watch all my videos. Bye.